Hello everybody, this is George Ponder for WPCentral.com. Got a video review video review for you today on Photo Room. Now, Photo Room, there is a Windows Phone application. There's also a Windows 8 and a Windows RT app. It's a photo editing app. We're going to look at the RT version that's running on the Microsoft Surface. Nice little application. Has a one or two little shortcomings to it, but overall it's a nice photo editor. Tools are laid out very similar to your Windows Phone version, everything down below. Just hit Choose to pull up an image. You can pull it from your SkyDrive, your Pictures Library. Just go with SkyDrive right now. We'll stick with this picture, hit Open. And there it is. Editing, you've got basic editing tools that cover cropping. You've got an edit brush where you can apply certain effects just to key areas of your picture. I'll show you that here in a few minutes. Exposure, color, sharpen, rotate, resize, flip, and mirror images. Go ahead and look at the crop. On the crop, you've got a one by one that keeps everything uh, proportional or just a, a freehand crop. So you can move everything around, hit apply, and there you go. Your styles, you've got uh, probably over 40, 45 different filters and effects that you can apply. Everything from uh, light leaks to different filters. Uh, let's go Como. You've got Chili Pepper. And once you find one you like, you just hit apply. Now you can stack these filters. Uh, let's go hazelnut, see how that looks. But you cannot adjust how much of the filter you want to apply to the image. Add a light leak, you can. If you don't like it, just hit cancel. You've got a handful of frames. Got linen frames. Now, come back here, <coughs> excuse me, to this edit brush. The ed edit brush allows you to apply four different styles to your image selectively. And you've got brush sizes that you can adjust the opacity of the filter that you're applying. And you can also erase it if you goof up, you just want to erase a little bit. But we'll go with brightness, set the level, and all you do is touch the part of your picture and it applies that effect. A little rough way to show it, but it demonstrates that you do have a little fine-tuned editing here in, in, in play with Photo Room. The biggest nit, biggest complaint I've got with Photo Room is you've got all this real estate on the screen and you cannot enlarge the image. It'd be nice to be able to zoom into a particular area especially if you're using the edit brush, so you can fine-tune that edit. But overall, Photo Room is a nice editing app for your Microsoft Surface or your PC. Not at the level of Thumba, definitely not at the level of uh, any of the Photoshop photo editing programs, but it's a nice handy little app. When you get everything done, just save as, give it a name, Give it a name, and you can save it as a JPEG or a PNG file. Just hit save, and it's saved. So there you have it, Photo Room for Windows RT. It's also available for Windows 8. It's available over at the uh, Windows Store. It's a free application. You can upgrade and get rid of the, uh, the ads. I think it's running at $1.49. I'll double check all that and have it in the post, as well as links to the Windows Phone Store. So, not, not Windows Phone store, store, excuse me, the Windows Store. So, there you have it, Photo Room, decent app, check it out.